there are a lot of videos out there about the DJI Neo, how to fly it. I even have a bunch posted up there and down below. But one of the things I found challenging and didn't see a lot of information on it is how do you get the files off of the Neo and align the video track with the audio track? I'm gonna step you through the process. I've got some ideas and tips in order to take something that could be very complex and make it simple and easy to use. The first thing you need to do is take a data cable. One actually comes with the DJI Neo and you plug in the USB-C port and then plug the other end into your laptop or computer. Turn the Neo on and I get a little click like that. It doesn't have to be fully charged. And then I'm going to go over to my screen and get to my PC shortcut. And you'll get something that looks like this. You know it's the DJI Neo because it has 22 gigabytes of internal memory. So you click on that and you'll see two files <laughs> DCIM and miscellaneous. So I'm going to go to DCIM. And then you'll have DJI 1. Click on that. And here's all the files. So a couple of things you'll notice here. A really long name. I think that's DJI, the date, and the time. And then you're going to have an M4A file, which is the audio track, and an MP4 file. And they will have the same time associated with it in date. But you'll notice the audio file is significantly less than the video file. There's also these SRT files. I save those. You really don't need them to put these two files together. Let's do a control A, select them all, import them over to your laptop, computer, whatever it is. Eventually they'll all come over. These names are kind of annoying. What I'm going to do is select edit more options, rename, and then I'm going to call this DJI Neo, you can put the date in if you want, 9 December 1 audio. And then I'm going to go down here, DJI 1 video, to indicate that this is the audio file, this is the video file, and these are tied together. So if you had multiple files, you could say two video, three video, ABC, dealer's choice on what you want to do here. After you do all that, here is what you'll end up with. I have a whole bunch of different things, external camera shots, I've got the Neo, and then I have the RC2 controller piece down here from the Mini 4 Pro and the RC2. When I go and add that into my editing software, I'll group it together, imported it all into my editing software, which in this case is Premiere Pro. This is all my other intro stuff, and then here is my video one in my audio track one. If you have multiple tracks, you really need to start around here and do the first one so that you're not overlapping. And then you just slide that on top. You may have a little bit of a lag here. For some reason I do on this one. You can just move this over here like that and then you go to your next video track and slide that in place. What I'm going to do is I'm going to find a part in the video where I'm talking. If you're not in the picture, syncing these up isn't as big of a deal as if you are. You just keep sliding these over and try not to overlap them. Come over here to this newer track. Control, this is very annoying. Alright. Now it's tracking me. You saw that it seemed like it was 100% synced up now. Now it's tracking me. Bad idea. Okay. So even though you have a gap here, it looks like a gap. There really isn't a gap. All right, there's actually video there. Sometimes it's really hard to figure out. That's why you got to look at yourself talking and you're not in the video. You can get away with it, right? Mini 4 Pro will track the Neo. It's pretty close, but I'm not sure it's completely synced. So let's move it a little bit like this. But see, now you got this video <laughs> gap you gotta worry about. Okay, so that looks pretty good. There you go. A real quick video on how to download the files from your DJI Neo to a computer, change the file names so they're easier to manage, and then import it into some editing software, in this case, Premiere Pro. 
Stay tuned for future videos on how to get the most out of your DJI Neo. Thumbs up and comments are always appreciated. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in all sorts of quadcopter videos, making and breaking things, designs of all kinds, home repairs, I even do costumes, cosplay, and props. Check out my channel and please subscribe because you never know what you're gonna see.